Hello everybody! I'm making this video today so that I can share with everyone some updates I have made to my van. For those of you who don't know me, there's a picture of me looking a little bit tired out after doing some hiking. And uh, I purchased a brand new 2020 Ford Transit van, medium roof and a 148 inch wheelbase. And I am an artist, so I am trying to transform my van into a studio on wheels and a camper van. And so, yeah, one of the first things I want to do is to put some windows in, the kind of windows that can open up. And I did not want a real closed in look. I'm not looking to do stealth uh, camping or stealth boondocking. I'm gonna be uh, wanting some big open windows. So when I first got my van this summer, it looked like this, like you see here in the uh, photographs. And it was basically had just one window that was on the sliding side door. And so it was all closed in like this. And um, I wanted some windows um, so that I could work as an artist and look out those windows. But I also wanted windows that I could open up to sort of cool off and also to be able to quickly um, vent my van and keep moisture from building up. Now, after buying this van this summer, I did do a temporary build. You can see a photo of my temporary build here. And I did take the van out west on a trip to Wyoming and Utah. And I just loved it. I really liked the way it drove. But uh, then I went and I also ordered this last summer some um, the windows and I ordered them from this company called Van Windows Direct and they retail uh, van windows. You can find them online and uh, took a while to get them because as you can see here, they even put on their website um, basically some information about how the orders were kind of backed up and that was all due to COVID. Now I ended up uh, ordering from two different companies. They handle windows from more than one company and to get what I wanted, I actually did a little mix and matching. So I got these CRL or CR Lawrence windows uh, that were the kind that opened up. And then uh, the kind of windows that I put on my van that are fixed and didn't open came from a company called AM Auto. Uh, as you see uh, here. But I think that the CRL and the AM Auto uh, windows do not retail to the public. Uh, they just manufacture them or maybe they wholesale them. But you have to go through a company like the um, Van Windows Direct uh, in order to get them. And so here's the info on Van Windows Direct. And I did like the fact that this company was willing to talk to me on the phone. There was a guy there that talked all about the uh, everything I wanted to know, including the fact that when I mix and match them, they don't exactly perfectly match in terms of their tone and curvature, but they did a pretty good job of matching them. And then the other thing I bought was a Max fan. Now you can go online and read about all the different kinds of fans that you can get for the roof of your uh, RV or van. And I ended up after all the pros and cons going with this company, um, in part because I heard that uh, when you bought the, uh, uh, at a level like this one, the 62, 100k uh, that it has enough different speeds that you can put on a low speed and not be too loud at night I was kind of uh, didn't want to ha have something that was very very loud and it comes in different colors This color is called smoke obviously it matches my dark color in my van But I noticed after I put it in there or after they got it installed that it actually is um, When you see it from the inside, it's actually clear looking upwards uh, in fact the blades of the fan are clear and the top of the van, uh, excuse me, the fan is clear. And uh, that makes it uh, look sort of like a skylight um, or a ceiling window. And you'll, you'll see how that looks here at the end of this video clip. I have an, um, an image of that. Well, buying the windows and fan is one thing, but installing them is quite another thing. And that is something that I could not do myself. So I had to find somebody and I wanted to, uh, to find somebody who had experience in installing van windows. Now I live in South Central Wisconsin and I looked around and I found this company here, Open Road Upfitters, and that is run by a guy by the name of Tony Wagner. And I'm glad I found him because I'm very satisfied with the work he did and that's why I'm bothering to give him a little bit of a shout out here and recommend him and his shop, Open Road Upfitters. His shop is located in a little town called Glen Beulah, Wisconsin. And it's a really tiny town, so I've put a pin on it here on the map, in the Google map. And you can see it's kind of in central, eastern part of Wisconsin. But anyone, you know, in Wisconsin or even northern Illinois, it's not that far of a drive. And uh, so, yeah, I went with him and I'm really happy with the work. I'm satisfied with the work he did. And the other thing I appreciate appreciate about Tony is that he didn't charge an arm and a leg for the work. He uh, charged what I thought was a very reasonable price for the work that he did. And here's a picture of Tony himself in his workshop. He's got a really big workshop. Uh, yeah, he's got lots of clients coming in. He's keeping himself very, very busy. 
and his workshop has you know all all the usual stuff for doing van builds he doesn't just put windows in he does everything he's got the materials and the uh, tools to to do a whole van build out and you know the whole um, solar addition and so forth there he is pointing at a battery system and so yeah I would recommend um, Tony Wagner if you if you are uh, looking for somebody to uh, work on your van in the vicinity of Wisconsin okay here we are on the side of the van we get a feel for the vents on the windows opening up to allow the air in and uh, yeah looks nice here we go Lawrence ones and uh, yeah I like the look of this very much I really really think this makes my van look just great yeah and you can see my my fan on the roof as well so we're making progress on the van build okay here I am inside of the van with the new windows as you can see you really got a very different feel now here with these windows all the way around. This has really opened everything up. And to get a feel for how they open up, you just turn the knob here and then they open up like a vent style, if you can see that. So we've got several places where we can open them. One here, and we got another one back here, and then we've got two of them over here that can open up as well, so as you can see. And then we also had installed our fan up here, which of course is not hooked up to the wires or anything else, but we get that fan going and we got these windows able to open. We'll get a lot of, vent lot of ventilation. And of course the main thing that I'm doing all these windows for is also because I like a van that's opened up. I wanna be able to sit someplace wherever I am and really be able to look outside and when I'm boondocking and maybe work on my artwork inside and so I like a lot of windows. So we got our next step done and we got a lot more to go. <laughs> 